Hey guys, I know I don't look my best right now. I literally just took a shower, but I don't know when I'm going to have time to film for the next good amount of days because of the holidays. And I've seen the track list from spin-off from The Witness and I could see that it would include some remixes of songs I haven't heard yet. So I thought I would do kind of like I did for the Paradigm um, drop, which is uh, get to listen to the originals of these songs before the album drops in a week, um, in about a week. So, I am going to check out Win and I'm going to check out Take Me Home. Uh, I have already um, checked out I'm the One, so no worries there. I have prepared lyric versions of both Win and Take Me Home and a live version of both. Both the live versions seems to be at least of some sort of credit because they seem to be like um, they seem to be official recordings from tour or something along those lines. So hopefully that means the sound is good and the camera work is slightly better than you could expect from other shows. And as always, I know that these lyric versions with um, the color-coded lyrics I know it's probably not gonna be completely accurate with the voices, but either way I'm watching the live version directly after, so that will pretty much help that immediately. So I thought we should start off with Win. I think I've heard a little bit of the chorus for that, but I'm not sure. Take me home, I'm not sure if I've heard anything from. So yeah, this is going to be pretty new. So let's just jump into win. Okay. And that's about all I've heard, that little part. Oh, 
you better do that I got you We gon' be winning or dead We gon' be winning or dead now Ooh. Oh, that's cool. That was cool. That song is definitely catchy. Wow. Oh, and I can just imagine that that's going to be a very, very energetic um, live performance. Oh, yeah. Let's let's just go straight to the to the live performance. Um, and it's from eighties uh, official. YouTube channel, so once again, I hope that means the sound is good. Jesus, my hair really just... Don't mind that. <clears throat> yeah, let's go. Ooh, that looks cool. <laughs> That's creative, like, very creative visually. Wow, okay. I can't handle Hang Jung with that hair. Shit. Oh my god, dude. Uh, go up your son. Oh my god, that's so cool! Oh 
Wow. Okay. Oh my god. Wow. Woo! That was even better live. Oh my god. Oh, I've seen clips of the beginning of this dance break, but not with the music. Wow. <sighs> oh, Jesus, that was intense. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> oh, and he said welcome to the show in the beginning when he came out. So I'm guessing they used to open the concerts with this song. Jesus Christ. Also just the way they were revealed on stage. That's a very creative and very cool way to open the show. So wow. Oh, I enjoyed that. That also that that's also just such a hype song, so oh, that's great. Oh. Noisy. You done? Just a crew of fucking teenagers on scooters. Okay, next up we have Take Me Home. I have... Hmm, I don't believe I've heard anything from this. So I don't really know what to expect sound-wise. The, the only thing that pops into my mind is from years ago when I was Hardcore Direction and Take Me Home was an album. So that's all that pops into my head. So I have no idea what to expect here from 80s. Don't know if it's going to be upbeat, if it's going to be laid back, whatever. So let's just get into it. Okay. Definitely a little bit slow. Not completely slow though. Mm. Oh. Wow. wow, I love this. Wow. 
And suddenly a saxophone? Okay. Wow. Okay. Woo! Okay. We love a saxophone solo. Oof. Oh my god. Like, I, I said that I didn't know what to expect. But holy fuck, like the lyrics were both very beautiful, but also very, very sad. And the song was just so beautiful, like the melody and everything. Shit. I can't even imagine what they, what they did with this live. Um. The live version I found is from the um, the Fellowship Beginning of the End concert DVD. Um, so hopefully that means the sound is okay. Um, yeah, let's just check it out. Those goddamn kids on scooters. Oh. They're not allowed to drive here, especially not that way. It's a one-way only street, but they choose to ignore that. Okay, that's... Excuse me? <laughs> what the hell is this? <laughs> That's just... <laughs> oh my god, son. Okay. 
Ooh. That's cool. Wow, okay. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, Songwa! <laughs> oh my god, Sama! Wow. Okay, that was cool how they just disappeared behind those dividers. I did suspect when, when the dividers started moving like that behind Sun, I did suspect that they would do something like that, but that was much more seamless than I thought it would look, so that was amazing. Wow. Oh. I really love this song, and especially, like, we're very used to, like, getting Jung Ho high notes. That's nothing new. That's not to say it's not impressive, but I love that we got a lot more of his falsetto in this song instead of his like usual like he he usually gets a lot of like mixed belt high high notes as like a key part of the performance, but his key high note in this was a very like volume wise low but falsetto that kept on for a while and I love the change up in that also I just want to say if you have seen this live in person I envy you because that performance was beautiful like I'm definitely gonna watch this video more than like more times that than is probably reasonable but it's just because it, this this was so it's a beautiful song the lyrics are also beautiful and they chose the perfect way to make the stage like wow i love how they really got creative with using those mirror dividers um with walking around them and them covering and wow and I kind of love that they weren't all like visible on stage until the last chorus that kind of made the last chorus like feel a lot more impactful in in the stage this oh this was stunning and I kind of regret not checking this out earlier stop it annoying people but yeah 
I'm so glad I checked out this and uh, checked this out and I can't wait for the spin-off uh, from The Witness to see what the hell that new song is uh, that is clearly referencing to Hala Hala and oh I can't wait I can't wait to see what the vibe of it is so yeah Thank you guys so much for watching and if this comes out before Christmas, have a nice Christmas. If it comes out, out after, I hope you guys enjoyed the holidays and I'll see you on another video. Bye!